Hello everybody, welcome back to another Matchday vlog today. Home of Southampton, big, big game in the Premier League. Probably the biggest game in terms of what's at stake today in the Premier League. Uh, neither side can afford to, to lose this game really, can they? I mean, like every game now down at Fulham has become an absolute huge game. Obviously, the defeat against Bournemouth, the last home game, feels like a lifetime ago now. And look at what's happened since. A lot's happened since. Obviously, Savita's now left. And a lot of fans are still quite disgruntled at that, but it's happened now, it's in the past. We have to look forward, and I do believe we've got the right man for the job now. In terms of who was out there, I do think Claudio Ranieri is the best man for it. He's had over a week now to train with the team. Obviously, a, couple, a few of the players have only just come back from international duty, I think, two or three days ago. So he's not had the full chance to work with them yet, but he should know the players who are... He should know them inside now. He's watched us a lot this season, according to, um, to um, Shahid Khan, who's... Uh, Appointed him, apparently Claudio Ranieri's been to a lot of our games this season, so it's not as if he's looking at it from the, uh, you know, it's not as if he's coming in straight away and hasn't got a clue, he, he's got a basic idea, he's seen how we play, so he knows temperaments and qualities of, of a couple of individuals, and obviously now he's had a full week to work with some of the squad players, so he's had a better chance to look at them first hand on the training ground, so it'll be interesting to see how we get on today, and come 2 o'clock today when the team is just pulled out, rolled out across all social media outlets at 2 o'clock, it'll be a a very interesting uh, interesting uh, spectacle to see um who we go for arguably 442 i think we is how we will want, how we will line up but i don't think we'll be as as counter attacking as Ranieri likes to, likes to play and especially at teams like Leicester when uh, that became quite a uh, a trademark really for Leicester i don't think that that's going to be the case with us i don't think we've quite got the personnel to do that and i think we will go more for a possession style of play until Ranieri can maybe get two or three of his own players in my prediction will be a 2-1 to Fulham be a huge game Come on, boys, we need the win. Armstrong for the cracking save and then Gabby Dini taps in the rebound but it goes off. Cracking save. Two brilliant save from Rico there. Could have been an easy one. That's brilliant from the goalkeeper. Superb early on. That's what you want. The confidence from your goalkeeper. Great. Two huge saves there. Brilliant. Stuart Armstrong makes it 1-0. What a joke. Defending there. Terrible. Throw in down the bar line. Scrambling away. Armstrong comes edge of the box. Low drive in. I oh, know. Rico got no chance. Story of our season. Can't, we just can't defend. We Go can't, we on, can't defend. Come on! Only one, though. Only one. It's only one. Come on. Still in this. Still in this. Come Get on. in there. That man again, Mitrovic. Get in there. 1 1. Come on. No, no, Mitro, no. Mitro, 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 Mitro. Lovely. Cross to the ball from the marshal. And Mitrovic just knocks it in. Woohoo! Yes! We needed that, we needed that, lovely header. Now Alex McCarthy, no chance. Well, that's a good good shot to score. 1-1. One, one. Lovely bit of football there from Fulham. Beautiful! Beautiful! Oh beauty, you beauty! Andre Shala! Woo! What a yeah! Right, Sessignon! Fuck little Messi there! Weaving him, weaving Paul 
those two players squares the ball and it's a tap in from Shirley at the back post short of half time oh god what a game Woo! get in there come on yes yeah come on lovely bit of play come on what's of half time yes 2-1 wonderful half time the winner we're actually winning for once 2-2 two, two. I mean, two one, sorry. In fact, been a bit of an up and up, up and down half. Playing some good football. Obviously, went one nil down. But these have been two really with the chance Gabbiadini missed. But then off that off that goal went in, we seem to have come back into it a bit more. Two lovely goals, really. I mean, Mitrovic's goal, lovely cross from the Martian, and even the second goal, Sessignon showing what he's really capable of, skinning them two defenders and crossing it back to the back stick for Schuller to tap in, and it makes it a bit more. Make, it makes life a bit easier now. I would say. It's nice to see the team playing with a bit of confidence. So the first goal seemed to rock, but once we've equalised, we're starting to play a bit better now. Long way to go yet. Southampton are very dangerous, especially Gabbiadini and um, Stuart Armstrong, although they're two main threats going forwards with Redmond on the right hand side and even Cedric on the right side of, uh, of defence is all looking good. So long way to go yet, but I think we can, I think we can hold it. Not 3 1. That's a huge save, man. It's McCarthy. Big chance for Mitrovic. How about 3 1? On the counter attack, that was some great play from Scherler. How's that not 3-1 to Fulham? It's a huge save, M wonderful save. That is a... Should be 3-1. Sure I know. We've got to take these chances. Stuart Armstrong, 2-2 again. What a finish. Right behind that. Right in the, right the keeper, keep no chance. 2-1, he... you weren't going to hang on there. With a big chance to make it three, and we haven't. And then he got over and stick it away. We're responding well last time, but against two conceded. It was a great finish from Armstrong. To be fair, one of their best players today. Really good finish. Again, it's our own worst enemy. Yes! He's got the second bit for it! Yes! Yes! He dropped! He dropped! He dropped! With Sherlock, you persevere with the ball in the corner. Who don't know what he's doing there? When you try, try. What a ball in. Session flicks it on. Mitrovic volleys it. He's back. With Sherlock, you don't succeed at first. Win that ball back. You try and try. That's beautiful. Fighting spirits. We want to see. Yes. The man's on fire. That's got to be it. That's got to be full time. Surely, oh my god, how we rode our luck, we've rode our luck so much. Come on, come on. Right, oh, free kick, yes, 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 come on, come on, come on. Come on, AK, come on. Just keep it, keep it, keep it. Leave it there. Stay there, OK. That's it. We're all right here. Yes, that's it. Yes. Yeah! 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 Full time. Full of three. Southampton two. Yes! 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 What a three points that is. Look at the other in his first game in charge. He does it. First win since August. Come on, Fulham, what a win! You three points, get in there! Oh my God, what a result. As you just said, all about character today. What a performance. We had to fight for every bit of, every inch we had to fight for today. Southampton tried their hardest, but they couldn't break us down. The Ranieri here is off to an absolute flyer. That's a thought we want to see every week. Just that belief and that fight to come back from 1-0 down, to go to 2-1, to go to 2-2, to 3-2. It's the character we want to see week in, week out. Regardless of the results, let's keep on fighting. Bring on them lot next week. Why can't we go there and get some in? I'm ecstatic. Get in there. What a three points.